Okay, so basically, once we stopped, it um, became apparent that we are not done. We are going to head up there again, alongside with a uh, TU-22 TU backfire that is going to launch a anti-ship missile at that ship we saw last mission. So I'm gonna set up the auto start mission, and I'm going to, since we are actually on an escort here, power. escort here, I'm going to uh, Copy. refill gun ammo and Request rearming. see if they can. Uh, power is now on. I want them to uh, reload the gun ammo and refill, uh, put some sidewinders on there. Thank you. We are also going to, uh, let's see there, that's a convoy right there. We're turning the on and radio to channel 3. Volume is up for that one, same thing for... Rearming complete. Rearming is complete, meaning we have taken on a full load of gun, gun ammo. And the plane we're supposed to escort is now heading out. The problem is that that aircraft is actually a Turn off the ground power. little bit faster than we are, so we Copy. might actually need to move to keep up with it. Now, it's we ground and a tornado that will be escorting that bird. And uh, I'll switch my guns on immediately, just so the... Gun sight will be starting, and uh, let's start a taxi right away. I don't see any reason to wait on uh, wait with that. Copy that, Sochi. We will be taxiing to runway two four, uh, trailing the uh, backfire. We also got a lot of attack helicopters here. One has to wonder why they didn't send one of the attack helicopters for top cover last mission. I think those would have been a far more successful formula. Uh, now I have to remember one very important thing. Um, I don't have as much fuel as I did last mission. And last mission my management of said fuel was subpar to say the least. Scope is good, and adjusting, yeah. We are lowering our flaps. So basically, the, we are so equipment strapped in our Air Force that Basically, to send one of our precious bombers away uh, on a mission, we can't send one of those F-18s over there or anything like that. They'll have to send a F-86 Sabre and a single tornado. Small rudder adjustment. Looks like the bomber will be taking the long way to the field, so we will simply follow him. Or, we actually do not need to do that. We can take the shortcut to the field. And then we simply hold position and wait for the guy to uh, take off.
closing the air brakes. Like I said, we're gonna let the backfire take off first. Backfire is uh, pulling out all stops here with its engines. Power up and get to it. We will be uh, heading out right after that one. Adjustments here. Make sure we are on target. There we go. And we have lift off. Wheels up. Relic one, stay in formation with the TU twenty two. After departure, the TU-22 will maintain a holding pattern around the airport until they see that you're airborne. After that, they'll proceed along the flight plan. Keep him at your 3 o'clock position. You'll be climbing to 17,000 feet at 450 knots. Copy that, 17,000 feet at 450 knots. It's kind of embarrassing because I lost visual on the gap. He might... Nah, there he is. Doomsday to Relic 1. We see that you're airborne. Proceed to Waypoint 1 now. Copy that, Doomsday! Um, should probably have been just better if they just had stayed on their present course and not taken out a turn like that, but... We're supposed to stay on here 3 o'clock and 450 knots. Now, this is probably the worst time to say that I'm not very good with staying in formation, like at all. So, I'll rather stay at his 6 o'clock. We'll try to slow the progress here a little bit. Make sure we actually stay with the guy and do not overshoot him. Uh, backfire 1, we will be testing our Sidewinder guidance system on you now. Please do not be afraid.
Backfire, we can confirm Sidewinders, give good turn, thank you. I think we might need to speed up a bit if we're gonna stay with the guy. Fuel quantity so far is good. Oh, there's the tornado. He suddenly came the fuck out of nowhere. I may need to um, fly a bit faster to make sure I keep up. The problem is I don't really have all that much more engine power to give if we're heading in this direction. Well, I can see them up ahead at the, at the very least, but I'm not really in a position to actually help them now. Then again, the mission briefing stated that I should stay away from the missile's path, and if I'm back here, then at least that is what I'm going to do. Okay, I think we're closing in on them again. The problem is I'll have to do a... 15 miles away from our position to launch. Roger that. If I was the enemy, I would say that the uh, backfire is probably a very tempting target for them. I mean, it doesn't look like we have many of them. And uh, the missile he's carrying is not something that... Ten miles away from launch. Copy that, we are closing in with you now. Slowing down a little bit. to extend my air brake so I don't overshoot the entire formation. We don't want to get ahead of ourselves, nor ahead of this thing. Three miles out, stand by for launch. Copy, stand by launch. We 
We are safely squared away in the 4 o'clock position. Well, more like 5 o'clock, but let's do it. It's away. Copy that. Get a visual on the missile. So if the missile is away, why are This is Doomsday, all aircraft RTB. Copy that, Doomsday. Relic 1 will RTB, I'll stay with you. Doomsday, where are you going? Ah, looks like Doomsday want to take out the sea a bit before they head to land on Sochi. I can understand that. Do we have any confirmation on uh, if the target was destroyed? See you, Doomsday. I'm gonna power up and head back to Sochi. Well, that was a relaxing mission. We didn't have to do that much. We launched, we helped launch a missile at our dastardly enemy, and uh, we can head back to Sophie Adler. I still can't get over how good this skin actually looks. I mean, it looks terrific. Yeah, we got Sochi right up here in the bay. Sochi, forward, one, one, inbound. Forward, one, one, Sochi, Sochi, forward, one, one, ah, inbound, wrong. resuming mission. Wrong button. We'll have to do that all over again. Sochi, forward, one, one, inbound. Forward, one, one, Sochi, fly heading two, nine, one, four, three, zero. Uh, cap it up. We'll get it done. Well, third time's the charm, ain't it? At least I hope so. I'm getting tired of just showcasing the pool landings here.
Got a visual on Sochi. Doomsday, any more contact on radar? Doesn't look like it. Looks like the tornado is uh, trying to slow down as well. I wonder why they sent up a tornado without any sort of weapons whatsoever. I can only assume its task must have been jamming. That or observation. I got a visual on the airstrip. Copy, runway 06 is the long one. And not the secondary strip. Flaps to 50%. And extend the air brakes. Now, I am suspicious about the landing wheels, almost all my landing problems so far has been related to the landing wheels. Uh, so I will not extend my landing gear until the last possible second. Or rather, maybe like 30 seconds before the last possible seconds. But I will not be extending them this far out. Copy that, Tower. Sushi, forward, one, one, request landing. Looks like we got a train down there as well. This is Relic 1, I say again, request landing. Sushi, forward, 1-1, one, one. request landing. Alright, let's pull the flaps over their eyes. Instead of pulling the rules, ah, never mind. That joke doesn't work if I have to explain it. Okay, so... People who are watching, am I going to land the plane. Cappy, checking landing gears. Landing gears looks solid this time around. Doesn't seem to be any trouble with them. Is this the day where I finally land the saber? Is this the day where Relic 1 will actually not be... Sweet! We actually did it! Let's see if we can also avoid our unfortunate habit of ending up on the grass. Because I don't want to end up on the grass, please. Keep off the grass. Keep off the grass. Keep off the grass and push the brakes. Sweet! We're back on the... Taxi to parking area. 
Roger that, we will be taxing to parking area for once in our lives. Well, that landing went a lot better, I would say. Let's try and vacate the... Yeah, I have successfully completed the mission. Sweet. So, let's just park next to that tower and uh, those fuel trucks. I mean... It's high time for lunch. We flew two missions back to back, or what rather the pilot character did, so. So, we deserve lunch, I would say. Now they will probably come and say this is not a parking spot, and then I'm gonna say, I don't care. Auto stop sequence is running, and mission is officially and irrevocably complete. Not that it was a difficult one, let's see how much fuel we actually spent on that. Uh, we actually did not spend as much fuel as I expected. I would say that I had expected that we would spend a lot more fuel on that mission, but we didn't. All in all, nice flying.